In today's video, I will show you the pro's secret settings to boost your FPS, fix FPS drops, and reduce the input delay in your games. So hit that subscribe button for more content. Let's dive into the video. Gear Up Booster is one of the best programs for the optimization of your ping while you play games using your wired or wireless connection. So get this paid program free from my description and play your game with lower ping. Head down to your search bar, type in control panel and click on system and security. From there hit up power options. Then go to choose what the power button does. Now here's a little security icon. Click on change it. Settings that are currently unavailable. Look for the turn on fast startup option. It's right here. This thing is supposed to speed up your PC startup, but we're not really feeling it. So uncheck that box hit save changes. So now go to my website, I give link in the description. Download the Pro's FPS Boost Pack and follow me for settings. Once this tool is actually open, you can up, now in here actually select the affinity for every single tool, game or program on your PC. What we of course want to do is click on the select program. Then we're gonna go here again under this PC. Click on the local to see program files Epic Games. Fortnite then, we have Fortnite Game Binaries, Windows 64, and actually select Fortnite Client Window 64. Shipping X make sure that this one is open up, so that we have actually Fortnite enabled in this tool. What we can now do in here guys, is set actually our processor affinity. So, for me, since I'm running a 13th Gen i9, I have actually 30 to virtual cores. So therefore, what I can do with this tool is here, is actually assign all of them, on the maximum amount to Fortnite. It's gonna be of course a little bit more beneficial if you may be running like 4 to 6. It's of course gonna be a way bigger difference guys. If you may be running something like 4 cores and 8 frets and you then actually assign all of the 8 frets for the multi-core rendering to your Fortnite. So therefore just simply make sure that you select the highest number and it's then of course gonna be a way bigger difference if you then assign all of the 8 frets for your multi-core rendering to Fortnite. This gonna boost your performance like crazy. So therefore, just to make sure that you select the maximum guys, amount, and make sure that Fortnite is selected, then under run, you're gonna put it to max, and then create desktop shortcut, then you can see shortcut created successfully, and now we actually have X on our desktop, over which we can always run Fortnite, with the maximum affinity of our CPU therefore, just let me keep this one somewhere on your here. desktop, and make sure to always launch a game over this exit, the tool itself you can actually close and uninstall, you don't wanna use it for any Next other, Next up, guys, we're going to be using a tool, which is called IO, and this one is super important. If you have high FPS drops in Fortnite with letters run H2, in the back, you can get it as well from my official website. And we're guys. going to launch a tool in the first and place. And once it's launched, guys, it should look exactly like this here. What you can see in the first place, guys. So therefore, what we gonna do is in the open first up place, the tool guys. and for the list set at least, you're going to put it to 1024, which is basically one gig of RAM, and for free memory as Lord. And you gotta put around half of your memory, which is available on your PC. So, let's say if you're running 8 gigs of RAM, you're gonna type in here for 5 if you're running 16 gigs of you're RAM, you're gonna put in here 8,000. If you're running 30 to 60,000, and you guys get the whole point right. So, for me, since I'm running actually 64 gigs of RAM, I'm going to put it 32,000 because of 1,000. Embed is actually 1 gigabyte. Then we also wanna make sure to start IELT, minimized in the auto start monitoring, and launch IELT on the user logon. This is super important, so that you don't have to do it manually. Every single time you launch your PC, then only rise head guys we have as well built Actually, in here. I must set resolution, which is gonna give us less delay when it comes down to free building. So, want a timer resolution? You're gonna put guys on 050. This is super important. Then you're going to click it under enable, custom timer resolution, and under IOC pulling rate. You're actually going to put this on a low to mid end PC. To 1000 and on a high end PC. You can put it even to 500. But for the majority of you guys, it's probably gonna be 1000 milliseconds. And then, just simply click under start, and let it run in the background, and you're all good to go. And we all know guys, the most important factor to having zero in dollar in Fortnite is having super low ping. And that's why not only Mero, but even Asian Jeff, and many other pros, are utilizing now the GR Booster. You can try this out for absolute free, with the link in description guys. And what this tool basically does, it's is, gonna actively look in the background for the best, and S server, ensuring that you have the least amount of latency. They also have this new which feature, which is called Adaptive Intelligent Routing, which is basically 2 for 7, scanning all of the active service in your near. Making sure that you connect to the one, which actually gives you the least amount of ping. That's why I'm right Only here. on 7 milliseconds ping, which is insane guys. And you can see the transfer is super nice. Therefore, make sure that you try it out for absolutely free. With the link free. in description guys. Now restart your PC to apply the changes. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, for regular updates and exciting content.